Hello everyone and welcome back to Jurassic World Lego. My name is I'm Mr. DNA and I make learning and Mr. fun. DNA is teaching us some more. The long balancing tail of Velociraptor is held stiff by long rods of bone jutting from their tailbones. Having trouble telling our pterodons apart, the crests on their heads vary from one individual to the next. I don't know if that's like completely unique, like, you know, fingerprint unique, or just kind of there's a few slight differences. I suppose they say all, they say all cows' ears are different or something like that? Like, finger, fingerprint different? And supposedly human ears as well, I think it's possible, like, with HD cameras it's possible to tell the ones connect by looking at their ears. That was definitely the fun show that I watched, just some description. I've no idea if it's actually true. <laughs> they just used it for dramatic license, but true. They set a trap. Yeah, they did. They do. actually set a trap. Is that your line? Maybe they were just playing mouse hunt and you interrupted the game. Is that the toilet brush from the first game? I think it is. <laughs> Thank you, tiny ninja! Oh yeah! This way! It's not safe! I know a place we can hide! Thank you! Which way is this way? That's not really very helpful. Camouflage. <laughs> Seek. Around dinosaurs by holding zero. Okay. So can I just walk straight in front of him? Apparently I can. Awesome. Someone stole Harry's invisibility cloak. He'll never suspect a thing. <laughs> Doing some kind of vehicle. Is that a hot dog on a car? Okay, yeah, we should sure. do it. Yeah, that would, that would get my attention, sure. We need to keep moving. You uh, need your daddy. Uh, what is that? I don't know. Yeah. Okay. Alan! Yeah, you have to hook oh, it to that tree. Yes, thank you, Eric. wide head so I can never find headphones that fit comfortably. <laughs> I literally had to wear adult sunglasses when I was like four because my head is just really wide. <laughs> oh. I bought some really expensive you too. skull candy headphones and I literally couldn't wear them because they were just too tight. Like I did the thing where you could, like put them on a book or whatever and like stretch them out and I left it on for like a fortnight and I still couldn't wear them for more than about half an hour without severe pain and so I had to buy these ones. I mean they're still very nice headphones. Come on, so, quickly! Um, Marley, I think they are. Yeah, Marley headphones. And they're very nice. Um, but Thanks. I would rather have not had to fuck out for two lots of, you know, quite expensive headphones. <laughs> And I can't wear the in-ear ones either, because um, they just won't stay in. I don't know what kind of fucking witchcraft you people use with the, you know, earbuds. I don't know how you do it, but it just doesn't fucking work for me. Another raptor. <laughs> so I just have to suffer. Especially, like, people run on treadmills with earbuds in. How do you do that? If I breathe too hard, mine come out. So it was easy with the button mesh. Yeah, fuck you, bitch. Give you a zap. Okay, let's go crawl into a dark hole. On an island where everything wants to kill you. It seems like thoroughly sensible. Alright, it's gone. No, well spotted, Eric, thank you. I wonder nobody likes this game. Oh, 
Oh, is he? It's cool. ill. We can't leave it like this. The raptors will no, eat it. No, we cannot. You are quite right, sir. Oh, you can do the dung diving. I see, I see. He's a puberty thing. Men can do it until they hit puberty, and then it's just too much. Too much smell. Oh. Oh. I'll give you a banana that you already digested. There you go. Nom 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 nom. That's nice, isn't it? Yes. You can't turn this. Ooh, cranky thing. There we go. Hello. You know what would be a really good Lego game? Die Hard. I want to see that. That would be epic. You think I am, motherfucker? Ice cream truck. <laughs> yes, this must happen. You're watching Lego producers. Come on. There we go. Let's go give him a carrot. Well, it doesn't get much fresher than that. I'm literally just dug it out the ground. There you go, sunshine. Is that chocolate? We're really gonna give the dinosaur chocolate. You can't even feed cats and dogs chocolate. Do you really think a dinosaur's gonna be able to digest that shit? It seems illogical at best. Yes, I am questioning the logic of a Lego game. Hmm. I have a question for you. I asked my friend this before and I think their brain exploded. So I'm gonna put it out there and see if anyone can come up with an answer. Right. So you know, if you're not very happy with someone, you say, it's a little below par, meaning it's not very good, it's a bit shit, but I don't really want to say that. It's a little below par. But like, isn't the whole point of golf to be below par? Isn't that mean you're winning? Isn't that mean, doesn't that mean you're winning? Like, if you go over par, it means you fucked up. Because you did too many shots, right? So why is below par a bad thing? <laughs> If anyone can answer this, please do. Raptors, run! No, I'm gonna hit them with my tail. Gonna see a shake tail through this. Okay, I'm gonna, there we go. Apparently, I roll like an armadillo now. And I flatten the fuck out. Bitch. Who is what? No, 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 no. You shall not pass. I just killed you. Ooh, family. Oh, make you a little below par, motherfucker. Slow-mo! That's nice. I like that. I enjoy it. Whoa, I was too close. Thank you, Mr. Ankylosaurus. I think it's an Ankylosaurus. My head is just through that hole. Don't quit me on that. What's going on? Oh, okay. No, I want... Can I not play this dinosaur anymore? I want to smash the thing. Where's he gone? Is he gone? No, he's there. Okay. Let's go. Can you not charge? Oh, so cool you. Somehow smashed the thing in front of me by using my tail. That seems logical. Bye bye! What should we call this guy? He looks like a George. Bye, George. Jump! Oh. No, that way. Stop being a bitch, Eric. Thank you. Keep going. There's a mini girl over there. I don't know how to get over there. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, Alan. Get carried away with my fuck off buttons. What we making? A scarecrow? What is that? Is that meant to be Alan? <laughs> what? I'm not sure what I was meant to do with that. <laughs> We're almost there. We we'll just ignore that like it never happened. Oh, there's another one. Let's build another one, okay. There can be only 
only one! Oh, I see, I build one and another thing appears. Right, well, I'm still gonna punch the shit out of it. But I needed all three of them at the end. Oh, okay, no, I didn't. I just needed to build you. That's fine. That's fine! Ow! We will find a comfortable position. Okay, that feels slightly better. Just suck it up! Get me out of here! What else does he need? Thanks a lot, Eric. You know who I am? Your parents are here. Yes. They're looking for you. I didn't. You're Ellen Grant. I was like, how did you know that was Eric? Like, there's gonna be what are you doing an, here? an abundance parents, of small uh, children abandoned by their parents. Invited me along. Yeah, be careful with that. T-Rex scares some of the smaller ones away, but it attracts one really big one with a fin. Listen. Copies. Yeah. yeah. I would like to know how he got to UXP. In my mind, he just kind of stood under it, like totally road. still, like. Meet a group? Thank Bad you. News. Luckily, the T Rex scares them off. Dad. Back. It was like a hold of them, wasn't there? I must be able to. Yeah. I must have to do that for them as well. Yeah. Can I throw T Rex P at that? I can! Yay! I'm so clever. Oh, I see you over there, Blue Stud. There's a lot of froggies over here. Alan! What are you doing? Thank you. Slicey slice. What are we cutting down? Presumably that, whatever that is. Maybe Arnold Schwarzenegger was here fighting Predator at some point? <laughs> That's the only conclusion I can make from that. And hitting small children. What? I don't know if I would call this like a herd though. A herd of companies? It's more like a. I don't know, it's a group. A gathering. It's a hoop nanny! A hoop nanny of compies. That's what we're gonna call it from now on. I love the word hoop nanny. Although, Jules Holland kind of ruined it. No. Pretend that didn't happen. Another buddy one. You weren't there. I beat you to that location. Can you give me a boost, Dr. Grant? So you're not strong enough to give him a boost, but Ellie from the first game is? Okay. Okay. Told you she so it wasn't Ellie, was it? It was What was the girl called? I've forgotten already. <laughs> Ellie was the girl, the adult. No, she was hench either way. Ah, fucking snakes! Oh, and it wrapped her. This better not be the right way. This is meant to be an extra bit, right? Don't mind me. I'm just a moving T-Rex bottle of piss. Yes. 
if I reordered that sentence, I'm sure it would make sense. Okay, if I change character, you're just gonna come back to me, right? I'm gonna assume yes. Maybe. Yes. Take it off. Thank you. Ooh. Weird thing to say to a 12 year old boy. snakes in Jurassic Park before. Where are these ones coming from? Dig! Binoculars? Dr. Grant, there's a boat! Yeah, there's a yes. boat. Right alongside the bank. Looks in good I shape. Know that sound. Listen. What? It's my dad's satellite phone. Is it though? I mean, it is the satellite phone, but is it your dad or is it a Spanish Dad! Mom! Eric! Eric! Oh, how, how did you know we were here? The phone! The stupid jingle from the store, I heard it! I don't have it. I loaned it to Nash. He must have had it when he. Sneak better if you don't walk on a dynamo. Top tips from Hawk. <laughs> okay, on to the next one. Oh, we broke a million. I mean, that would be nothing when I got all the bonuses and stuff, but for now it's good. Skip faster. Going this way. Ah, uh, yes. Okay. We need mommy and daddy. Oh, wait. We need Alan first with us? Yes, we do. <laughs> now we need mommy and daddy. Not you. Not you. There we go. plumber from working in, from having his own business and everything, but plumbing and electrical fitting is slightly different. You'll find a great dino fat just down there. Uh, I've read that one. It's about stegosaurus. The bird cage. Oh dear. Ah! <laughs> I thought they'd be worth a fortune, enough to fund the dig site another ten more years. What if they catch us with them? What if they catch us without them? There's a boat at the bottom, just downriver. We'll try and make it to the coast, at least. Yeah, I never would have thought of that. I'd just been like, LEAVE THEM! Although I'd be quite surprised if they survived. Like, I mean, 
it just on someone's back. They wouldn't what is it? Be warm, would they? It's a bird cage. Although it's supposed to be quite a warm climate, isn't it? So maybe they would. Ah. Hello. Ah. I'm gonna go the other way now. Eric! Ah. Hi, Eric. It's nice seeing you for five minutes. We'll come back in another year. Six months. Because he flew away. situation here we don't have time to admire the graphics Overgrown chicken. Uh, yeah, sure. Can anybody grow shit? No. Oh, oh, yes. Why? You randomly. No. Oh, I thought Mustachy Dude came up. Oh, must have been this. Okay. No. It's gone. There we go, finally something we can do. With the company present. Yay! Why? <laughs> I thought he was gonna fly straight into me, but that was a bit scary. It's a little bit scary. Be careful. Yes, we did. Bye bye, Bertie. So, we're supposed to climb up there, so it's something over here. Oh, a shower. This is taking a while, but it was something looking good. Ah, oh, another target thing that we can't shoot. Nope, there's nothing. Hang on. Hang on. I'll find a way up for you as well. Come on. Trampolines are so useful. Oh, 
Why are you doing that there, useless muggle? I got this! That is a diving board. I'm sure you do, Billy, but I'm gonna go this way first. Because there's carrots, and you might need to see something in the dark. Maybe there's a mini kit! I knew there was a reason I went this way. I didn't go any further, though. But that would be stupid! Okay, Billy. Send you into the abyss. You got his attention, all right. I am also possibly not. Awesome. Yeah, well, that's fine too. 
Punching that would have been a stupid idea. I don't know why I tried to do that. Let's go to these guys. Wait, shoot them again! Hey! What the fuck happened there? Oh, uh, no way. We'll go away, I said. Get in the fucking thing. Actually knowing explosives into your face. It's all good. Nothing to worry about. Change characters. Oh, let's for help. Thanks again for watching. Bye!